Oh, YouTube. Um, quick, where I'm at. Um, you know, what I've done with these now is just give them a oil wash of um, Van Dyke Brown. Uh, I was quite happy with them. I didn't bother to put any highlights on. So I'll just give them a quick like coat of, um, of matte varnish to take the, the shine off from the gloss. Oh, I'll also paint the tank commanders there. Ready to go in. Um, what I plan to do now is, is um, just use some pigments probably, put a bit some rusty pigments perhaps on the spare bits of track, some soot, soot around the exhaust stacks and the gun barrels and then with the tracks and the bottom bottom of the holes and that is just use some earth pigments, dust them all up to take, to tone those um, shiny tracks right down, make them look a bit more sort of muddy, mud, mud them up and, and stuff. Um, what I'll do is come back and show you when they're done and see how they look. These, these have come out a lot lighter in colour compared to the sticks I've done, which I quite like. I, um, with the oil wash that I used, I just used a thinner wash than I did before, so it's just a bit more subtle and it hasn't stained, stained them as much as the others did, so, which I'm not worried about sort of um, army. They all look the same in the same army, long as each unit looks the same, I'm happy. So. Okay guys, final show on these tanks, they're all done, just done a bit of weathering on them, I've um, put some soot on the barrels and exhaust stacks, um, I don't think it's going to show up here but the spare bits of um, track links, I've put a bit of sort of rust powder on those and then and weathered up the tracks and the side of the tanks with a bit of um, mud coloured pigment, it's not coming out very well in there. I've just noticed the side of that track there I've missed and I haven't paid my aerials. <laughs> but anyway, you get the general idea. So I think they've come out alright. They look a bit better in the flesh but they look pretty good on here as well. So that's those finished, they're all done. This is one of the guys I've done before. They're a little bit lighter than that one. These are going to need another coat of varnish as well so I'll probably make them all look a bit the same. Yeah, all done. I'll show you for you. So that's that project finished. Um, I've got nothing here really I'm going to work on at the moment. I plan to go to the Colours War gaming show in a couple of weeks. So I'm not really spending any money on the hobby at the moment. I want to save all my money and and sort of spend it when I get there and have a look around the trade stands. So what I plan to do now is maybe do. I've got a cutload more of. Oops, these just little kidney shaped bits of wood and stuff. So I might have a go at making some more scenery, maybe some um, lakes or marshes or something. And plus this board that I'm spinning them on, I'm playing, I was thinking, I was thinking I'm going to um, sort of do like a grassy sort of um, texture on this because I'm not going to use it in the house anymore. I've commandeered it, so I thought I'd have, have a go at doing something with this little turntable. Maybe put some, um, well, yeah, just grass and sand on it. So, that's it, really. So, hope you like them. So, I'll see you all again. Take care.